Hello, in this tutorial I'm going to talk about how to navigate through matrices in MATLAB. In the last tutorial uh, we covered some basic functions and operations with matrices and uh, as last time I will start uh, by making uh, a random 5x5 matrix. You can see it on the screen. Now I'm going to first tell you how to access a single element of that matrix. So let's say we want to access the element in the first row and in the first column. So that's 81. What we type is x, open parenthesis, 1, comma, 1. So 81 uh, got displayed. Now uh, what if we want to access more than one element? What if you want to access, like, uh, I don't know, the last three elements of the first row? What we do in that case is x of 1 for the row and uh, 3, 2, 5 columns. So 16, 14, and 66. Now, what we could also have done here is x open parenthesis 1, comma, 3, 2, and this accesses the third element to the last element in the first row. This will display the same uh, three numbers as the first function did, only this is useful if uh, at the moment uh, you don't uh, know how long your uh, matrix is. As you can see, same story. Let's uh, move on now. Now let's uh, access uh, everything except the first row and the first column. So we will do that by writing x, open parenthesis, 2, 2, end, comma, 2, 2, end. As you can see, we have uh, everything except the first row and first column, and that's now a 4x4 four four matrix. And that's it for this tutorial. I uh, must admit that this tutorial is uh, a lot shorter than my usual tutorials, but navigating through matrices is uh, really easy, and uh, there's uh, not really much uh, story to it. Anyway, if you have enjoyed this tutorial, please subscribe to our channel and check out our website, the link is in the description below. Thank you for listening.